hey guys uh this video is for people who didn't didn't understand the edit distance uh, this matrix problem using db like how this matrix is basically working and why we are using only these three as a minimum and yeah why not the other adjacent and all so let's first understand um, by the simple the what uh, has been asked in the question so let's say we have um, uh, p and e okay so how many ways we can convert this into this right one way is let's add e and then delete p okay this is gonna take one plus one two transaction another way is we have p and e simply replace this with p uh, e simply replace p with e so the total transaction is one right now coming back to the so this is the basic thing remember like there is a possibility of two there is a possibility of one since the question is saying return the minimum we should return this now coming back to the matrix so yeah initially i was like why the hell we have this and why we are using in the matrix so this is guys basically to just um, go for the corner cases that is what if the first string is empty and what if the second string has some string and then what will be the conversion uh, yeah so this is just to uh, fill the corner cases boundary cases that we said so yeah let's understand this so basically this empty string empty character and this empty character are same right so whatever we so uh, uh, yeah so let's say we had p and a and c and a so here we know that we so we, we are now only focusing on the minimum one so ideally we will replace it with p and this is same so we will left it over similarly what we are going to do here is if this is the same just place the zero so uh, let's use a instead of p for this um, understanding purpose so um, yeah so a is a is zero again zero right because they are same now what if let's say we have a p over here right then this will be one okay now again a is a is same but what this one is saying that i have a one transaction required in order to convert p into an empty string so that is why since we have to return the total transaction we have to remember our previous minimum transaction right which is one and this is why this matrix is useful to know that what transaction has happened and minimum and we will see that later on so this will be one plus one and zero now the main part of our question is like uh, this right why we have this sort of three guys playing on right so yeah yeah so we'll discuss uh, this cell that how we got this one over here right so i have a copy of that cell so this was our answer so let's go step by step and understand this so let's pick first two so from empty string to become empty string a and b it takes two transactions okay 
like from empty string to become empty, this guy we draw action now when we have this we say okay i need to land at this point then what is missing is a so we'll give a to our transformed to transaction so here it will say so what we want in the end is empty string a and b right in the end we want empty string a and b at this position okay so now since a is already present and since both are equal you can say just remove this that will be delete which will be one transaction one plus one will be three transaction so if we follow this path from b to coming at here it will take three transactions now let's consider one so from empty to empty a it takes one transaction one transaction this one transaction right now what we saying that we need to add a and b this a and this b in order to reach here because our target as of now is to reach here so we are saying that we need to add a and b to this uh, to this after this state okay so and the result what we expect from this is again a b right so what we will do is to get this one we will remove a as we have already a present in this one so we'll do the delete transaction which will be one so this one plus one will give you two if you come from here so if you are getting confused with why i am using one transaction and adding this here then remember over this concept that we have used this one just to remember that what is the earlier um transaction has happened right this is what it is so and in the end our result is to reach this point to basically convert at this point from the given state to this state to this here now our we will look for the this one so for zero so so this we have reached from so yeah we reached from uh, empty a to empty a right empty a to empty a at this point so this both are equal so basically zero transition is required now from this state we have to come over here so what we are lacking is b right so to get this b to get this b we need to simply add b which will be one transaction the total transaction will be 0 plus 1 that will be 1 right now since the question is asked for the minimum uh, transaction we should use use it one right because all of this three now what if we use this state to come at this state okay so let's see so from empty a b to empty a what do you need to do is we have to remove this 
to we have to delete this right which will take one transaction right that is why we have this one now our requirement is to reach at this point okay so what we need to do is we have to sort of add p now you will say like we already had p but remember we want to we are moving from this state to this state which is almost like backward so yeah so after this we, we will reach with um, yeah so this basically represent that how we have converted in how many transaction we have converted this into this so that is one transaction and now uh, in order to move here we need to add p again so that will be adding of p which will give our target result and which will be a add transaction so total transaction will be one plus one equal to two so if we come from here the transaction will be two which is still smaller than one now the question is why yeah, so the fact that um, basically this one is uh, and a total transaction is getting added as we are moving th this way so these values are getting increases right here and this way so here we also saw right even we have used this it is smaller than this one and the reason is why that we are adding this transaction right